In this video we take a closer look at Python functions. To define a function in Python, use keyword def, followed by the name of the function, a list of input parameters in round brackets, and a colon. This is called the signature of the function. The statements that form the body of the function start at the next line, and must be indented. The usual indentation is four spaces. The first statement of the function body can optionally be a string. This string is the function documentation string, or doc string. To define an empty function, use keyword pass. In Python there are no procedures as such. All functions return a value. If no return statement is given, the function returns value none. Let's now consider function swap, which swaps two elements in a list of two items. Now consider the following sample function. This example is important to understand Python policy in relation to variable scope. If an input parameter is passed, or a variable is defined locally within a function, as in the case of variable A, Python will use that variable. Otherwise, Python will look into the enclosing function, if any exists, or in the global symbol table. Let's consider now the case in which we aim to pass to a function an argument list of arbitrary length. Function print table take two parameters, header and persons. The asterisk before persons indicates that the function may take an arbitrary number of variables when it is called. Finally, let's have a look at parameter default values and unpacking. 